15 minutes. <laughs> Food of life is such a beautiful thing, don't you think? If you guys are doing this content, don't forget to like this content here. Also, click on the bell. Come on, be a part of the notification. Dang! <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. Keeping it basic today, guys, and just making some good old homemade bread. Homemade bread. <laughs> basic necessity that every household needs. If I can show you guys how to make rice one day, I'll show you guys, all right? <laughs> okay, to this beautiful bread. We're taking it slow today, guys. One cup of warm water. To this one cup of warm water, I got some after dry yeast. A tablespoon of this, okay? After a tablespoon of that going in, we got this, good old sugar to feed this beautiful yeast. One tablespoon. Mix this in for about, I don't know, 10 seconds. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. I'm not a baker. <laughs> okay, 10 seconds after, we let it sit, guys. We let it sit until all the foam comes up, right? At this time, guys, I usually like to clean up a bit. You know what I'm saying? You guys see the foam? It's coming. It's coming. I like to put things away. I'm going to show you step by step, guys. So it looks like I'm not cheating you guys, all right? Okay, once you guys watch that, I'm gonna chop up some butter here. I'm gonna chop up two tablespoons, okay? Just tell me when the yeast gets activated, okay? You guys gonna see some foaming action. Once you guys see some foaming action, please call me, all right? Quan. I don't say. <laughs> this is a bad idea, but I'm gonna do it because I wanna show you guys. Don't do this at home, okay? I'm a professional. You know what? I'm not gonna show you guys. I'm gonna cut it on the side, okay? Just imagine me cutting butter on the side. I'm putting it in a bowl and popping it in the microwave just to melt. Uh, see that foam going? Yeah. <laughs> yeast is activating, guys. It is activating, my friend. Okay. Just melting some butter right now. Don't worry, guys. If it's activating, just let it go, guys. Butter's still melting. Don't have to panic. Don't have to panic. Yeast activated. I'm gonna go in with two tablespoons of this beautiful butter. We're gonna crack in one egg. Shabam. Next, wait, let me wash my hands. Make sure you wash your hands. Do this. We're gonna do two cups of flour going in. Okay. Take that beautiful clean hand of yours, get into it. I kinda did like two heaping cups, but it's okay. Just do what I do, okay? Two heaping cups. A little heaping cup, okay? Not a lot. Now all we're gonna do, guys, come on. Oh geez, I know you guys there. What are we looking for? Come on, yell it out. All we're looking for, guys, is a nice, that's it, guys, that's it. It's a nice, I then. <laughs> Then we're just gonna knead this for 10 minutes, okay? Or until it becomes nice and smooth. Everybody needs bread in their life, okay? I'm gonna show you guys some nice soft dough bread here. And again, guys, I wanna say that I'm not a baker. <laughs> I go by feel, you know? Why do grandmas make the best breads? You tell me because they go by feel, right? Why do people in general make good bread? Because they go by feel, right? Who started it? Like who started making bread first? Think about it. 
the first person who ever started making bread first, you think he or she went by a recipe? No. They went by feel. Right? Whose recipe do they follow? There was nobody. It was just them themselves, right? Like who started ground and flour or grain to make flour, right? Exactly. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take you step by step. See how this dough is coming together? Got some dough in my fist, so I'm gonna punch it out. Nice. You get a good workout? Who misses my table? <laughs> it's such a strong table, guys. I think like four years. Four years I've been rolling dough, pasta, everything, guys. Legit, everything on it. And it still didn't break. There was one time that what, a screw fell off, and that's like the only time. And I was amazed. I just screwed back on. And it was still going. <laughs> see, that was awesome, guys. Hey, see this? It's forming nicely. Just pretend your hand's the machine, you know? You know how the machine goes? It just does this. But you got the manpower, the women power to need it, you know? Okay. Mm -mm. You could be fancy and just do this. That's what I see a lot of bakers do. <laughs> and you guys, I'm just an average guy that goes by feel, okay? There it is. Was that 10 minutes of rolling or knee? I say this. We're gonna cover it like so. Both sides. And we'll just let it sit, guys. 30 minutes. All right? 30 minutes in. So, I got a baking sheet here with some parchment. All I'm gonna do is spray this up with some little oil. I got a bread scooper outer right here. Can be used as a rice scooper or a bread scooper, okay? Flour on the counter. Flour on your bread scoop router. Best investment I ever made. <laughs> Take out your dough. Just let it flop on there, okay? Next to this. Toy trap! I'm not saying I'm really good, but just check out this cut. That's smooth. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna cry chop this into four. Toy trap! I'm not trying to brag or anything, but that's how clean my cuts are <laughs> haters are gonna hate guys so okay what are we gonna make today guys I'll chop this in. <laughs> okay first things first let's do we can do anything we want guys you just need a weird imagination remember i told you that <laughs> okay let's do i don't know mini buns yeah let's do two mini buns Okay, see what my hands just did there? We just pinched it, just to get a nice smooth surface at the top, okay? This, onto our baking sheet. Uh, okay, a little too much flour. Mini hot dog roll, okay? Press it down, fold it up. Both sides, fold it up. Is that a hot dog roll? <laughs> a big burger bun, okay? Big burger bun, same way guys, see where my hand's doing? It's pretty much folding it under, like so. Then you pinch the bottoms, like this. Twirl it around, form to a nice, a beautiful circle. That's beautiful. Uh, those. We got three burger buns and we got a small hot dog roll, okay? We're gonna let this proof for about, I wanna say 20 to 30 more minutes before we start baking. As we let this proof, we're gonna bake our buns at 400 degrees Fahrenheit and we're gonna put the rack on the second level, second or third level. Me, second level, all right? You guys following along or what? <laughs> okay, I wanna say 10 to 15 minutes in. Did I tell you guys to cover it? I forgot to tell you guys, cover it, all right? I'm gonna preserve some eggs here, so I usually do an egg wash on top, but now I only have a few eggs left. I'm gonna do some butter, and we're gonna do some honey. Just a tad, maybe three tablespoons of butter to maybe half a tablespoon of honey. I'm gonna beat this in. 
I'm gonna taste this if it's good. And it's delicious. <laughs> okay, ready? Oh man, butter and honey is delicious. This is gonna give it a nice gloss and buttery taste, okay? And hopefully, this butter does not burn <laughs> in the baking process, okay? We're gonna wash our patties. Patties? Burger patties? Wow, I'm saying patties. Oven's preheated at 400. All right, we're gonna do, toss it in at the second and third rack for about, I wanna say eight to 12 minutes, but keep an eye on it. But I'll give you the exact time after, all right? Twelve minutes in. This is what I'm gonna do. Just because I feel like one spot is hotter than the other, I'll flip this around like so. Ow! 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 That's hot. A few more minutes. Here we go. Total cooking time or baking time. Fifteen minutes. <laughs> okay. The color on the buns look good. Ow! The color on this. Looks all right, but that's all I'm gonna do. Take some more butter. This is a clean bowl of butter, guys. Not the same one, okay? I'm gonna gloss it more with some butter. That is glossy. Okay, I'm gonna let this cool for a bit. It's tempting, guys. I wanna just go into it right now. But we gotta let it cool for a bit. It's light. It's delicious. Check the bottom. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, see the bottom. I'm not even a baker. Right? You see my measurements? All over the place. How did I achieve this? Like I told you guys. You gotta have a weird imagination. <laughs> That's beautiful. Let's do it guys. So, hot dog bun. <laughs> hot dog bun didn't come out looking too great because one side is thicker than the other, but it's okay guys. Still fits the hot dog. Look at it. Look at that glisten of butter and honey. Moment size for this, please. Okay, it's going to burn my hand. Nobody say anything. Oh man. That's a nice soft dough right there. You guys see that? That is soft. That is airy. Here. Nobody say anything. <laughs> I'm not a baker. What is this? Quick time. That's good. Nice. Super pumped for this. Fresh bread. Who doesn't like fresh bread? Super pumped for this. Hmm. Honey butter glaze. Oh man. Mm. Is that? Always look for a. Come on, you guys know what it is. <laughs> always, guys. Always look for a nice soft dough when you're making bread. Oh, super pumped. That's so soft. <laughs> it's like a pillow. In my mouth. Like I'm shaking like I just I just wanna break everything. But it's so delicate. Mmm. -hmm -hmm. Honey butter freshly baked right out of the oven. Look at that bottom. That's absolutely amazing. I would say shelf life. One day. <laughs> Why? 
there's no preservatives in this. So, if you guys know where I can get preservatives, <laughs> this will probably last a week if I have preservatives. Shelf life, one day. You can freeze them. But I want to say, it won't taste as good. Mm -hmm. As right out of the oven. Yeah. yeah. I'll cut this now. Look at this. Oh, man. I'm not even sure why there's a pocket in there, but it looks amazing. I'm not even a baker. <laughs> Bakers, if you guys are watching, rate my bread. Right. Oh. It's so soft. <laughs> mm. Just imagine putting your hot dog on this. Mm. <laughs> That's delicious. Okay. Make this for your family. Don't go out and buy bread. I don't want to make it like a, a panic thing. Just go out, get a bag of flour. Eggs, butter, yeast. Make bread at home, guys. Preservative free. Mm. Nobody say anything. This knife, guys. Cuts through everything. It's weird because it has teeth on it, but it cuts through everything legit. Very sharp, guys. If you guys don't want any knives, guys, Wilson. Wilson Wong, go on his Instagram, DM him. Wilson Wong is epic. You hook it up. Can't wait to put a burger patty on this. Oh, man. I'm going to save this for tomorrow. I'm going to freeze it. <laughs> Nothing beats fresh bread. Mm. I'm gonna slice it first. And I'm gonna freeze it. And when I make burgers, I'm gonna just heat it back up. Nice and soft and glistening. Next time I'll do this mixture, butter and honey. Butter and honey makes it. I don't know why my stomach, if you guys hear, my stomach is growling. Maybe it wants more food than just bread. <laughs> but my stomach doesn't know that. It's fresh bread. Just wait until it hits my stomach. Then they'll know. <laughs> That's delicious, guys. Make this for your family. All right. That's it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Peace out.